United Grind Society presents The Turntable, where we discuss everything relevant to hip hop. I'm your host, Haiku, and today's topic, we're gonna to be talking about hip hop groups and which members we'd want to actually kick out. So the one stipulation is that the hip hop groups gotta have three members or more. All of that on The Turntable. All right, hey. Thank you all for checking us out. I uh, just want to, before we get started, you know, obviously we want to mention that this episode is brought to you by the new 90s Spotify playlist. So please check it out, stream it. It's hot, hot stuff on there as well. So before we get really started though, before we start in this, uh, talking about this, this topic, I think it's going to be really, really interesting. I can't wait to hear what y'all have. First, we got to introduce the panel. So to my left. Back off of vacation. <laughs> That's his name. Siege, me, Doc. There we go. Speed, Rhyme Royal, his name at. His name is Speed. There we go, there we go. And then to my right. I already know, man, it's Jinx. Hi, Jinx in the building. And I would do want to highlight that this is the first time we had the four originals. Mm. And a good little while. Yeah, that's mm. why I was saying. A little treat for y'all, you know what I'm saying? Yep. No doubt, no doubt. All right, well, let's let's get into this. So we talk about hip hop groups, right? And I know I've, we've talked often about hip hop groups and the members in the group. Uh, if we were to kick out a member, Tupac. Okay, no, <laughs> a, a, a group. Right. All right, a group. So if we have a hip hop group, if we wanted to kick out a member to make that group better, right? Uh, I'm interested to hear what you, who y'all have. Now I would say better. Or, you know, for some reason, one or the other, maybe the group could have gotten better. further without <laughs> further. You know what I'm saying? Better. You know, you got yeah. members that the whole thing. Now, some of, them, some of them are obvious, though. Okay. Like, and I'm. Uh, like, yeah, I mean, it's, it's reveal time. Some of them are obvious, like <laughs> Jerobi. Yeah. What did you do to you? Wait, what, yeah, what did he, what did he that do was, period? That was, that was on my list. <laughs> oh, Jerobi's on your list. See, I ain't wanna. I, ain't wanna, I just figured some of these was. Like two just off bat was like, okay, these are very obvious and I was trying to pick other people than them. Cause like Jerobi was like the joke of the group. Oh, who, who who bought Tribe Records to hear Jerobi? Mm. I've never heard him. You last, never heard Jerobi? There's a reason. On the last album he rapped on last album was not mad at his performance. What was the last album called? The the, the the after five pass. I the think, album after five pass. Huh. I wasn't mad at that album. Yeah, he did, he did rap on that. All right, so it took him 20 years, <laughs> two 20 decades. Years. Saved up hip-hop anger. Okay, see, I was, say, I was saying Jerobi and Send Dog from Cypress just off rip. Mm. Send Dog. <laughs> wow. See, I, I feel like, I always think of Cypress as a duo, but... Alternate. I feel you, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah you know what, I thought that before you put the three-member... Right, right. Whatever. Because I mean, you know, that's why. Because when you, if you get rid of a member in the duo, then you got a solo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, solo, yeah, yeah. So it was then, a solo. Then, then, then anyway, the episode though. might as well just be what artist should go solo for right. the group. You know, so three or more members. That's what I was thinking. Um, you know, I didn't know Jerobi was gonna hit like that. Even though, I, right. even though <laughs> I, I love Tribe. Oh man. no, not Jerobi! Right, 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 right. I, I love Tribe, man. The Jerobi thing, it was always confusing to me. So I, I did. Have Jerobi on there, um, you know, the same thing with like Pretty Lou. Woo! Pretty, pretty Lou. Pretty Lou. Okay, Lost I didn't Boys. think of that. Mm -hmm. Yes, Pretty Lou was was on my. Who else rapped in that on that group? Freaky Ty, right? Freaky Ty. Did he? Rest Did he rap? Rest he Freaky Ty was Freaky Ty. He's a hype man. Hype man. He was an integral Freaky part. Freaky Ty was dope. He did his thing. I just don't remember him rapping. That's what I'm saying. You know, when, they lost, when they lost that, Lost Boys wasn't the same. You're right. That, you're right. that, that meant something to the group. Right. You know what I'm saying? You're right. It yeah, absolutely. Cheeks. So yeah. why Pretty Lou over Spig Nice? Damn. <laughs> I, think that, I think that might be interchangeable. You know? Right. <laughs> hey, one got to go, I, though. I don't remember. Maybe, I think maybe Pretty Lou may have done a verse or two. Okay. So, might be speaking. I might yeah. be switching. No, no, that's a good one, though. I didn't even think of them. All right, speaking of that, mm. the group has a mixed history anyway. Okay. The group is D12. The artist is bizarre. Mm. Yeah. Okay. 
Now here's the thing. A lot of people think D12 is junk. There's some D12 spinners in D12. D12 has some dudes that can rap. But when you get Proof. to that bizarre verse, yeah, Proof. he was definitely just that. Bizarre is a good one. That novelty. That's a good one. That novelty act within the group. It definitely threw me off. I mean, not to say that, you know, that I would consider myself a D12 fan or that I know a lot of their stuff. I just know when I remember hearing them, it was kind of like that, you know, moment yeah. when Bizarre starts. So, yeah, yeah I, I feel you. No, nah, I'm with you on that. My thing with D12 is, like you said, like, I, I didn't have none of the albums or anything, but... At the time when they were out, I would just listen for the Eminem verses. <laughs> honestly, <laughs> honestly, but as I'm listening, I'm like, who is this dude? Because he rapping, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I'm like, who's this other dude? He's nice. And then, mm -hmm. like you said, Bizarre would come on and you'd be like, what the fuck? Okay. That's so, a good one. So I know we have some more. So I, I mean, we got plenty. Okay. Yeah. So Brad, it's, it's your turn. You got? Uh, you got. Ah. Yeah, that, that, that was coming. I knew you that got. was coming. <laughs> I knew that was what? coming. What? How could it not? How could it not? I'm, I'm but I will say this. I will say this. Um, Can I ask this? Yeah, go ahead. Was you guy even on the first Wu Tang album? Barely. Raw, I'm gonna give it to you with no trivia. Okay, straight from Bolivia. Bolivia. Yeah. yeah. Hip hop. Rock and I mean, that's pretty. That's a pretty classic. Rap it is. Though. A, a, wait, as I was saying, I was like, yeah, don't know all the words. That's, that's why I'm that's where I'm at with, with you guys because in, 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 in Wu Tang in general though because with with Wu Tang all of the pieces come together to make this thing right yeah. and everybody yeah. like that thing mm -hmm. if you take any of the pieces away do it kind of screw up that thing right so here's and here's, that's that to me that would probably have to be the most important question with all of these people yeah is if you take uh, that piece away does yeah. it change the course right exactly. so if you took you got out Wu is still Wu. You think so? <laughs> Without that verse? <laughs> I think they would have been okay. Yeah. <laughs> they had been all right. And honestly, that was, that, was, that, was supposed, that was supposed to be in Kappa anyway, but Kappa got locked up. So, you know, and I think Kappa would have fit in better. better. Yeah, anyway. I think I didn't like Cap to Winter Wars. I heard Winter Wars, and that's to my day one of the best verses I've ever heard in life. Well, let's not make this a woo. Yeah, you're right. Seven. You're right. You're right. But you got it. that's that's my one. Okay. I think anytime you have groups with like superior people, superior artists, it's like like take Outkast, right? So you no, got Outkast. Not. And there's, there's, no, 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 I'm not talking about taking nobody out of Outkast. I'm just saying, a, right, like right. Outkast as a group, there's nothing wrong with anything Big Boy's bitch. Like that dude's. Great rapper, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but you wouldn't think so listening to people talk about the group Outkast. Right. Take you know like, give me Andre and it's like Andre and the other dude. Mm -hmm. Sure, sure. You can't have nothing it. other dude about Big Boy. Nah, right. You know, know what I'm saying? Big Boy, yeah. Organized confusion. There's people, nothing other dude people about Prince Poe. Okay, okay, sure. yeah. But they be playing it off like they're saying they never. There's never an other dude situation with Big Boy. You haven't heard nobody talk so. about that? I've, I've never heard nobody talk about oh, man, no, people other talking dude. crazy. I, I, they don't say yeah, other dude, like but... rap records by himself. But 3,000 gets all the credit. Okay. As far as, yeah, as far as in the conversation of, like, goats and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. definitely. All right. I so, what about, uh, what about Prize? From Prize Who's? gotta go. Wow, that's it's, a good they, one. I, you know, I thought of that. That's I definitely no thought brand. of that, but I don't think that there's a Fuji's without Prize. Stop it. I think some of that rhythm, you know, some of that styling is, is Prize. Prize was a businessman. <laughs> Prize was a businessman that they said come do some help. I don't think there's a Fuji's without Prize. No, nah, Prize was terrible, man. I'm Prize. not saying, let's see, and that's the thing, it's not a question of if, if they're <laughs> terrible. Talent, right. this, it's not, to me, it's not a question of that, it's a question of... Well, then you're about to X out all of my, you're going to X out all my picks here then, I if we go and buy of that. Of course, of course, your picks are your picks for whatever reason, yeah. but I feel like the number one question that we should probably ask is, do the groups exist without these specific members? So, do they, right. or, so, do they make the same impact without... So let me say this. So let me say this. When I thought about this question, I I was thinking about in in the the human body, we've got tonsils and you've got an appendix, right? And you're born with them. But when those people, when those parts <laughs> of the body go bad, you can those parts can be taken out. And 
the null effect is the person can still function, he's fine, no big deal. So if we're looking at a member of that group that could be taken out. You saying there are no body organs, that's what you're saying. Hey, that's what, no, that's what I'm looking at. I'm, that's, that was a question I asked my mind. That's deep. But you know, the older that I get and I look at and I've heard interviews and you know, if I look at like, uh, I've been on teams where I've seen how teams, like sports teams, how they interact with each other. You might not have a cat that's actually on the field, it might not be player. the fastest. But he's the glue for that particular mm -hmm. team. Role player. And I think that those guys that we mentioned, you know, I think Proz might might fit in that category. If he actually did the history, you know, he actually might fit in that category as being one of the forces that actually kind of kept things moving. Because otherwise it's just why Clefton and, and, and seeing that, that and seeing that all of us are parts of a group. Mm-hmm. Or were at some point, or some point in time or other, mm -hmm. we also have to keep in mind those. There's those aspects of creativity that may not actually be seen. That's true. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like That's hooks true. and things like that. Like who knows? Prize might came up with mad mm -hmm. hooks. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or some shit like that. So you never know when it comes to that. I feel you. But um, I'm taking him out the group. But I, I feel hear you. <laughs> I feel you though. I, um, so you can still do that from the bench, bro. <laughs> That's right. I right. think I got one okay. that y'all may not have. Okay. Mm. I'm going to have to take out uh, Dell. Wow. Oh, Hyrule. Hyrule. Man, wow. Wait, so, so let me. Let, there let me, is no Hyrule without Dell. I don't care. <laughs> I mean, they're, they're no, physically yeah, would not even exist. Obviously. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, they, they I, I'm not, very aware of that. Yeah. But, you know what I'm saying? That's a what? A eight man crew? Not yeah. eight, nine man crew? And I, I don't like Dell. I don't. I'm hearing more and more of that lately. That's a lot. Like, like I, I, I haven't been, this, I haven't heard that. I haven't heard. Like the world is no, no. Like lately, no. not just you. I'm just saying a lot of people lately. I've been hearing people say they don't like Dale. And I'm like, he ain't had a record in how long? Or how did people just now all of a like sudden? Like it's just like yeah, resurfacing. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? Somebody posted that uh, that 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 uh, song. That he had, I oh, think yeah. it was like the Lynch Mob song about black girls. Yeah, or that was shit. Joe. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cross. Okay. Joe Miles. That's okay. where it was. I don't know if that was like some viral shit or what, but, yeah. you know. I can feel that. I like Dell a lot. And I understand but, that but Dale. I wouldn't argue. And I, and I understand <clears throat> that Dell is the leader and yeah. creator of that shit. Yeah. I, I get that. I know that. Yeah, so, I feel But it's, it's still my pick. I like Dell, but I can understand where you would get that take from. So I wouldn't even argue right. with Man, I'm not, it. I'm not doing that with you. <laughs> Alright, I got one. This is going nowhere. <laughs> these two, these, these two, well, one of them is just personal preference. Okay. Okay. I didn't even. I wasn't even crazy about the group. It's just that I think I would have liked the group more without this okay. person. As, I like that. Sp the ghost. Mm. Mm hmm. Okay. <laughs> Wait, wait, get quiet real. for him. Wait, get quiet for him. I'm, I'm one of the rare people, and I know I'm one of the rare people that like I like Sheik more than 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 Styles. I've always said that I liked his aggression. When I liked first came out. I thought she was trash. I don't think this. I don't think this. Wait, they ain't coming out. I don't think this episode is coming out. I don't think this episode is there, nigga. I, have you seen the radio interview? I probably did. Which one? I know he with Styles, it. nigga. I'm sure Styles is a good dude. I'm a street nigga and I'm keeping it official. <laughs> what that got to do with rapping though? I'm just saying that, that nigga came with. What it got to do with living as well? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He showed up. He showed up. Yeah, that's what he's saying. But okay, cool. No, I'm, I'm sure. Well, Styles then I'm gonna get get mad. Mad. Well, then I can't even say the next one then. Well, well, hold up. Well, this, well, this <laughs> write it down. <laughs> write it down. <laughs> Man, we're going to prove it. Man, we're going to We're going to have to see. Obviously, obviously, we gonna have to see I'm going to last one I'm in gonna, the comments. I'm going to have to, you know, just put That's this cool. on record. Obviously, I disagree heavily. Okay. You know what I'm saying? There's no other group that has the back and forth. Like Jada and Styles, man. How could you not have that? But that's the here's the thing. Here's here's the thing. I don't even dislike Styles. That's the thing. It's not like I'm saying he's whack and I don't like him. Mm -hmm. It's just that I was not a Locks fan to begin with. Right, so okay. when I did hear the Locks, I listened for the Jada verse. Mm -hmm. I listened for Sheik's energy, yeah. and I felt like uh, Styles' energy was low because he had the monotone type flow. So for me, it brought the energy down. I wasn't fun really fact. Yeah. Did you know the Styles was left off of the All About the Benjamins because Missy Elliott didn't like his verse? Really? Wow, that is. Where, how'd you find that out? How'd you find that out? <laughs> I read that shit somewhere. 
Okay, I was going to say, she put it up. Why can't we put ours up? <laughs> Missy wasn't scared to say it. <laughs> but we scared? No, nah, man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I'm I, I, I fuck with Styles Heavy, just person. I mean, you know, it's all, you know what I'm saying? It's all in fun and, you know, definitely respect your opinion on it. But it's just strange to me because I definitely would expect most people to say she, even though I personally, say, I, know, I disagree. And that's why I said most people. I like do. she. I like she. And I think she's yeah, the most gotten broke better. out of the three. Yes, right. definitely. Definitely. Yeah. definitely. Yeah. When they right. first came out, I thought she was the weak link. I thought uh, Styles was trying to sound like Jay Z, and I thought Jada was dope. So with the group, I was like the group felt uneven. But as they went on, it all kind of mm. balanced out, and they all like, right, okay, I felt all pretty kind of. Mm. Okay, uh, what's your next one? Because I have one now. Oh, okay. this one, see, this one probably won't hit like the Styles one, but this is just. You didn't know the Styles was going to hit like that. No, I had a feeling. Did you? I had a feeling. <laughs> you still did it. I love it's it. Hot, it's <laughs> hot. You still did it. It's hot. I'm just, I just want them to know. It's, it's I just how want, I feel. I want them to hey, hey, I'm not disrespecting of, nobody. It's just how I feel. Right. <laughs> this one. <laughs> All right, so I was a big fan of this group. Okay, and that's why even when they were big and I was young, mm -hmm. we always would say this dude doesn't need to be in the group. Mm -hmm. Now, it's, it's emotional because mm -hmm. this group isn't the same anymore and they fell on some hard times. I'm sure that this was going to be one of mine, but go ahead. Willie D? No, that definitely <laughs> was one of mine. Damn. Is he his eyes? <laughs> <laughs> what? You was a Willie D fan? I fuck with Willie D. I fuck with Willie, Willie D right now. Willie D can't rap, man. The OG Willie D. Willie D can't rap. Is the girl did. boys the girl Willie boys did. without Willie, Willie D? No. Yeah, yes, they were. You know no. why? Because they added uh, what's his name? Big Mike. Big Mike. They took Willie D out and put Big Mike in. Oh man. And everything was fine. Ah, oh, see, it wasn't fine. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't got no classics with Big Mike now. That whole bad. album was banging. They ain't got no classics. Willie D is some of that glue stuff you talking about. Oh, oh Willie D. Willie D is some of that glue stuff. Man, Willie, Willie, D. Willie D. Willie D. Willie. Willie. Fuck with this dude talking about. You was some glue, man. Uh, Willie D. Glue, glue, baby. And this, and, see, and this is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Willie D is a cool dude. I met him in Columbus, actually. That's the funny thing. Yeah, we was at the cages hooping, and he said, "I got next." And I was like, "Is that Willie D?" <laughs> <laughs> Why is Willie D calling next <laughs> on Ohio State's campus? And he was cool as fuck. Mm. That don't mean I like your raps, but mm. I mean. So you know, I got I, one of them. I think it's only I think it's only appropriate, and um, I think I can get away with this. What you know? You about to say something crazy? No, I'm not about to say anything crazy. I just think, you know what I'm saying, respectfully. Yeah. I think, you know what I'm saying, that we all have the right to speak so on So Dell was your first one? Well, yeah. The, what, that was your first pick? Because I, you, I mean, you said that you had like three. I didn't really have a first or a okay. second pick. All I right. mean, I, I had a couple people who I thought of. All right. Obviously, you know, my one of mine was you guy and Jerobi, but uh, and it, this is probably my last, the last one that I thought of. Um, Flesh. Ooh. Ooh. And the only reason I say that is because of the jail. Mm -hmm. The jail time. Mm -hmm. Flesh was probably mm -hmm. the illest next to Busy. Mm. Crazy. Or crazy next crazy. to crazy. Yeah. He was probably the illest, but I feel like God damn, you know what yeah. I'm saying? His head was floating on the fucking album cover because the nigga couldn't Look, take a picture with the group. Right. Do you right. feel like when you, when you listen to Bone, do you feel like do you feel like you distinguish each member in that way, or you could be like, all right, this dude is the best. This dude is, you know, can you tear them dudes listening to? I, I I think I can tear them. And you feel yeah. like Flesh comes in where? Just just. I mean, I'm wondering, like, is your answer because of his 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 his, his jail strictly time? because of his jail time and the fact that he missed the big the group's biggest part of their. So journey. you're saying the group got big without him? Yeah. They, they, so you're saying? Yeah. Ain't, ain't it's too late. <laughs> Come you on, know what I'm saying? Now it's too late. But yeah, I mean, to me, flesh <clears throat> between, I would probably tear him, biz. The second spot would go between lazy and flesh. You know what I'm saying? Back and forth. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then Wish and uh, Lazy. Or Crazy and Flesh, and then Wish and Lazy. Yeah. Or Lazy and Wish. I got you. 
Who's your favorite member in the group? Busy. Okay. So, you know. And like I said, I mean, Flesh is, is dope. He always been dope. You know what I'm saying? For the love of money, is like... Yeah. But I'm like, damn. You know what I'm saying? He, I don't think he was intri- you know, an intricate part of... Yeah, I forgot about the love yeah. of money. Now that you mentioned it, I forgot it. Yeah. 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 Oh, I'm surprised that no one mentioned... Uh, uh, I'm just gonna throw the group out, and y'all can pick the name. Uh, Onyx. Wow. I'm surprised no one did that. Wow. That well, he left, didn't he? Remember that dude? He left. Did he? So he, he, did, he, did, he, did, he did the he job did. for him. <laughs> I forgot his name. I did. Exactly. <laughs> I did too. Hey, Sunny something or other? No, Sunny Seas is. Was it Boy or something? Um, oh, you got, you got sticky. The ball head. Look at the ball head. Something. No, hold on. You sticky got sticky Fredro. Sticky Fredro, Sunsees, and sticky. You said sticky. Yeah, sticky, Fredro. This is what we got this for. Yeah. Sunsees, Sunny Seas with the Big DS. Yeah. Big Sunny. DS. That's it. Yeah. Timo from Goody Mob. I mm. thought about that one. I did think about that one. Okay. Not mad at you. But I wasn't like crazy on Goody Mob like that to begin with, so. I'm well, I'm a Goody Mob fanatic. Really? I disagree. <laughs> what's your favorite? <laughs> what's, your, what's your favorite Goody Mob album? Soulful. Okay, all right. So you didn't think he was going to have a name, did you? Huh? You didn't think it was going to no, I was just curious. You didn't think I was going to have a name of an album? <laughs> I, was just, I was just curious. Uh, Timo, yeah. It's like with with that dude. Best, I mean, you know, I could see like, cause I really wasn't a big Goody Mob fan when he first came out, and I grew, it grew on me. But with him, it's like it feels like Uncle Rap. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you got some. <laughs> this is I mean, like, like Uncle yeah, like, Rap. Yo, 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 my uncle can rap, man. <laughs> <laughs> my uncle can rap. I'm telling you. Let me hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Where we at on time, nigga? This shit is hey, Before we do that, I'm just, I'm just realizing that actually Big DS actually passed away. So oh, I killed the dude so off, man. Yeah, we, uh, we we gotta say rest in peace for that. I didn't know I didn't know. I didn't know that either. So, so no, see I see I was thinking it was Sunny Sea. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. You thinking of Sunny Sea? You you can try to clean it up now. <laughs> I only thought it was three members to begin with. The very first album, it was four of them. Okay. But he didn't do a whole lot. Right. Well, rest in right. peace, baby. Yeah, rest in yes. peace. Rest in peace. Absolutely. All right. Well, hey, thanks for checking. Thanks for checking us out, checking out the video. Let us know. Let us know. Yeah. We're, we're, how we're, mad you are. Oh, you don't hear that. Oh and then let us know if you have some picks, maybe some people. Yeah, we'd like to hear from y'all. I know what the first pick going to be online. That light skinned nigga. <laughs> the turntable. <laughs> that nigga. His name is Siege, y'all. His name is Siege. Yo, peace. Thanks for listening. Yep. Ooh. Are y'all Styles affiliated? <clears throat> oh, we got Styles affiliated.